Hmm. Searching updates on her social media accounts. Looks like she haven't been updating a lot since we broke up. I wonder how she is doing since the last time we spoke to each other. Does she feel any remorse when we broke up? Should I send her a message update? Should I ask her how is she doing? I'm getting agitated that I don't know what the heck is she doing right now. Was I to blame? Was it me all along? Was I the toxic one in our relationship? Was I the one who made our relationship turn sour? Am I a bad lover? Am I a bad person? Why is this feeling eating me alive? I can't take it anymore. I can't take all the overthinking. I must see her. I must talk to her. But what should I say? How should I approach her? Would she even be happy to see me? Would she even be glad to hear from me? What if she rejects me? Am I ready to be rejected? Am I ready to feel that I am no longer needed? I don't want to be forgotten. Especially by her. I want her to want me. I want her to need me. I want to make her want me back. Is it wrong to want her to want me again? Is it wrong to ask her to want me back? I can't think about anything anymore. I can't think straight. I can't help but think about her. Only her. I want to see her so badly. I want to see her. I don't care anymore. I must see her. I must go see her. Even if I have to look at her from afar, I would do it. I just badly want to see her. I don't have to overthink this through. I just have to go there. This spot is good. She won't notice my car here since it's kind of dark. I'll just wait for her and see if she is doing okay. I just want to make sure that she is good. Should I just text her? Should I just drop a message saying I'm outside? Should I just come to her apartment? I really don't know what to do. Why is this so hard, when all I want is for us to get back together? This is mentally tiring. What should I text? What should I say? Ugh. Wait, that's her. What is she doing at this time of night? Wait, she's not alone. There's someone with her. Who is that prick next to her? Looks like they are talking about something. I want to step out of the car and listen. Wait, wait. They look like they are arguing about something. Why is that guy forcing her to go somewhere? This is not right. Hey, get your filthy hands off her. Don't you ever dare to come near my woman ever again. I'll see you and it's the end of you. 
Yeah, run away, you coward. You don't want me to get messy with you. Now, let's check if she is okay. <clears throat> hey, are you okay? Hey, hey, why are you crying? Don't cry. I'm here, I'm here. You are safe now. You don't have to cry. Is it okay for me to escort you inside your apartment? Don't worry, I won't be staying. I just want to make sure that you get inside safely. Or if you don't want to, just let me walk you through the entrance of your building. I hope that is okay. So, I think that guy will not follow you up to here since everything here has CCTV. That dude better not do anything funny again towards you. Well, I don't want to take much of your time. I better get going. You take care and make sure that you lock your place well, okay? Huh? Is it really okay? You don't mind if I have a cup of coffee at your place? Um, um, no. I don't really have anything else to do, actually. So, yeah, I can have a cup of coffee. Huh? Finally, she is laughing. Looks like she is calming down after what happened. You sure love to tease me. Anyways, can I have a cup of coffee now so I won't be staying at your place so late? I don't want to be intruding. You don't have to be a stranger. I know this place so well. I'll just make myself comfortable, so don't worry much about myself. You can just go to the kitchen. Unless, do you want me to do the lemonade that you really like? If you don't mind, instead of giving me a cup of coffee, cause I don't really mind making you one, since it's been quite some time since I last served it to you. I mean, I miss doing it for you. Really? Then don't you mind if I borrow your kitchen? While I prepare the drink, you can wash up. I know you had a long day. I don't mind. Just relax, and it's like this place is new to me. This place hasn't changed a bit. I could still say that it's the same apartment where I used to live before, but I mean, it's not like we broke up that long. No, it's okay. I found the things I needed. You don't have to worry about it. <laughs> it's not like you changed the place drastically when I left. Just finish your shower. I'll just place the drink on the table in the living room. I'll wait for you there. You can as well take your time. As I observe everything, nothing really changed. Looks like she didn't mind that the interior still has traces of me. Did you have a good shower? Feeling relaxed right now? What the heck is she wearing? I could see everything. Shoot, shoot, she's coming near. I could smell her already. I could smell her. It reminds me of how she sounded like when feeling good. I could not help but push her down and ravage her here and now. I could feel it. I could feel my little boy waking up. Think of other things, like, oh, look at the ceiling. 
Think of your other self. Calm yourself. It's not the time to be thinking of dirty deeds. You are just frustrated. You should really take care of your needs when you arrive home. Huh? I'm sweating? Nah, maybe I just exerted too much effort in doing your lemonade. I'm okay. You don't have to worry about me. Now, do you want a cup of lemonade? I'll pour you one. Here you go. I hope you still enjoy my special lemonade. There's that face that I miss staring at when having a relaxing moment. How I miss these moments. So, if you don't mind, who the heck was that person? Yes, I mean the guy who almost assaulted you. Was he someone you were currently dating? What do I care about? I know that we broke up. It wasn't that long ago. And I really don't know what happened between us. I don't know what to say. Even though we are no longer together, I still care about you. You know that. How could I not care about you? When I still want to be with you. What do you mean I'm unfair? What is unfair? Was I the one who wanted to break up? Didn't we decide it together? Because we thought that everything was already messed up. When in fact, I really want us to work out. I still want us to be together. I just don't know anymore. It's just I'm happy that we could talk like this. I don't want us to talk about it anymore. It's not like we could go back the way we were. It's just wishful thinking. I think it's not healthy for us to be in the same place. I better go now. I don't want to argue. Well, since I know where to go out, I'll just take my leave then. Make sure that you lock your place well. What the heck? Why is she kissing me eagerly? Why is she doing this? I'm confused, but I don't want to stop. This feels good. I missed her taste so much. Hey! Why are you doing this? Are you okay? I don't want you to regret doing this after you get your senses back. Hey! Why are you crying? Please don't cry. Are you hurt somewhere? Please don't cry. I don't like it when I make you cry. Please tell me what I should do to stop crying. Come here, let me hug you. Just calm down. I won't be going anywhere. I'll be here. Just stop crying. I wonder why she kissed me. Does she want us to be together? I really don't know. I just want her to calm down. Are you calm now? Please, tell me. What made you cry? Please, baby girl. You don't have to be shy about it. Tell me, what's in your mind? Please tell me. Yes, I would love to. I would like us to be back together. I'm sorry for breaking us. I'm sorry if we had to go through that. Please don't cry. I'll be here. I won't ever leave you again. I'm so sorry, baby girl. I love you. I love you so much. I won't promise you, but I'll do everything to be good to you this time. I'll take care of you and gain back everything that we have lost. I love you. Thank you. Thank you.